we are counting 1 to 20 we are counting 1 to 20 we are counting 1 to 20 and this is how we do it how are you grade twos are you okay i'm fine it's your teacher annunciator welcome to easy limo learning simplified measuring capacity and we said what is capacity capacity is the quantity a, a container holds and capacity is measured in liters do you remember we said length is measured in which unit length is measured in meters now capacity is measured in capacity is measured in liters and this is how you write the word liters capacity is measured in liters the volume of a container the volume of a container the volume of a bottle is what you call the capacity so i've been told to find out how many cups fill the big container this is my big container and now i want to find out how many cups will fill this big container let's see we go one two three four five okay, looks like an orange is no six seven so how many cups fill the big container eight cups have you seen eight cups will fill the big container so i'll come here and write how many cups it is eight cups that will fill that big container now i'm being asked how many cups will fill the big jug let's see this is the big jug and here we are with our our cup you see one two three four five so how many cups fill the big jug there are five cups that fill the big jug five cups fill the big jug let's see how many cups fill the bottle because we don't have a uh, a funnel we assume that these are five cups la, 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 la. let me subtract how many i subtract two cups if i remove i had five cups in the jug then i've removed let me just measure the cups and see So I have one cup, two cups, and three cups. So I've been told to measure how many cups fill this one liter bottle. I see. almost three cups you're remaining with a little water in the jug so we are talking of two and a half cups so it's approximately three cups that fill the fill the bottle so you're saying three cups 
So if you are told to compare the jug, the big container, the big jug, and the bottle, which one is big? The big container is big, followed by the big jug, and then the bottle. Okay? So when you go home, I want you to measure the capacity of the capacity of the washing bucket using a one liter bottle and tell me how many bottles fill this washing bucket then we have a washing basin tell me how many liters will fill the washing how many bottles will fill the washing basin any question up to there nice i hope i will see you in the next lesson as we explore more ways of doing capacity thank you